from WFSB. This is an Eyewitness News update. Good morning, everyone, and thanks for joining us on this Friday, March 22nd. Here are your top stories. Waterbury police are looking for whoever they say shot and killed a 26-year-old man who was just walking away from Waterbury Superior Court towards State Street yesterday afternoon. If you have any information, please give Waterbury police a call. Also, a $500,000 grant is coming to repair the Congregational Church of Thompson. And this comes after a fire destroyed the building back in 2016, almost eight years ago. Phase one will start by early next year and last about nine months. The cost to repair the church could be as high, though, as $2.4 million. So they're still trying to collect some more money. And the UConn men's basketball team will start March Madness with a face-off against Stetson today. You can watch right here on Channel 3 because tip-off is at 245. The women's basketball team will also play in stores tomorrow at 1 against Jackson State. All right, Mike, over to you. Nicole, we've upgraded tomorrow to a first alert weather day. We're expecting some slick spots to begin the uh, day with a bit of wintry mix and freezing rain, especially across northwestern Connecticut, followed by a period of heavy rain. We're talking 2 to 3 inches of rainfall, if not locally higher amounts, renewing the risk for flooding. So while it's slick in the morning, Rain in the afternoon. Temps will be back in the 40s through the afternoon hours. Breezy and drier on Sunday. Monday will be in the upper 40s. Upper 40s and low 50s Tuesday. And then the chances for rain increase by the middle of next week.